Hey guys, I'm back, and let me tell you about how I have repeatedly tried to record the game Knuckles, Knuckles, and Knuckles. Now let me tell oh, oh, first, we gotta listen to this banger. It's a long way to the moon, lads, but the green cheese of longevity will make it worth the trip. Up, up, and away. The green cheese of longevity? Now, what's that? I, I, song, song. Let's go. I know this is like the equivalent of doing the final level first, but whatever. If they let me, I will listen to the moon. This ain't the moon. Oh, theme. I've never been to the moon before. Mm. Well, when it comes to space cadets, Fenton, you're a natural. <laughs> now, Gyro, why in blazes are we chewing this awful blue muck? <laughs> why, that's Oxy Chew, Mr. McDuck. It's my latest invention. That is such a weird Gyro voice <laughs> compared to the modern show. Surface without a spacesuit. Oh, and it tastes great, too. That Gyro is a matter of opinion. <laughs> Now, which way to the green cheese? What do you mean? Isn't it all around us? Yeah? How do you figure? Everybody knows the whole moon's made of green cheese. Well, that's what my dear mama said. And did it take a feather brain like you to believe her? Really? The I rumble's going on. Wait, what's that? Look. Green cheese? Wait, wait, wait. The whole moon is Hello? full of green cheese? Now, normal cheese, I can... I can get, but green cheese. The moon is not green. We do if you want to find that treasure of yours, Mr. McDuck. Fenton was carrying the Gizmo Duck suit. That's the only thing we've got powerful enough to break into the moon vault. All right, fine. Stay here and guard the supplies while I look for that bumbling bookkeeper. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yes! Ah, this is the... Uh, I kinda want this ice cream. Looks like the same spaceship that took off with Fenton. Well, <laughs> I guess this means I'm invited on board. Cool. Onward and upward. He's really taking the discovery of aliens pretty lightly. Hey, I guess in this continuity or it has discovered oh. oh. yeah I'm scared to commit see that's why I was scared to commit Giving. So, so there's this Sonic fan game called. Okay, well, it's a ROM hack called. Let me guess. Oh, no, I can. Totally. It's called Knuckles, Knuckles, and Knuckles. And I've been wanting it to play on the channel for years. All my attempts have been what? Awarded. Oh, 
See, and just now I'm getting the idea, hey, why don't I just look it up on my web browser, on the computer, because I never did that for some reason. But, here's a fun fact. Blast me, bagpipe. A piece of gizmo duck suit. Oh, if only I had a way to open this door. Uh, you know, flash clothes. No, I can't do that. I almost kinda wish I could play this, this level without ta talking because this music was so amazing. Thank goodness you're here! I think those aliens wanted to suck out my brain and make an army of Fenton clones! Bah, they'd soon learn that one of you is one too many. Now, what does Scrooge have against Fenton? Get to your gizmo duck suit. You mean this? Security system disengaged. Fenton, you're a genius. Gee, Mr. McDuck, do you mean it? Oops. Warning, damage report. Artificial gravity system is offline. You're on the moon. You broke the gravity controls. Not to worry, I'll have it fixed in a jiffy. I got a level 3 certificate of technology from Happy Ducky University, you know. Oh, no you don't. You'll probably slam into the self-destruct button too. I'll get us out of this. They are on the moon. The moon has gravity. System restored. All systems normal. Nice work, Mr. McDuck. There we go, not hard at all. Not so fast, Dunderhead. You go wait with Gyro. I'll find a gizmo duck suit myself. I could not done that. I know there's one down here. Okay. <laughs> Maybe this is a Metroidvania. It's Gizmo Duck's helmet. Oh, if I didn't know better, I'd swear Fenton actually gets smarter when he wears this thing. Uh, maybe a wee bit too hard on the lad. Seriously. He, he's done nothing. And we can break into that moon bolt. Benson didn't do anything wrong. Okay. Space ducks. What if aliens were just ducks? Honestly, that'd be pretty cool. Of all the species on our planet, for aliens to like look like, ducks are not one of them. But. Ah. Ah. I see. What were you saying, Mr. Food? I love that animation. Oh. Oh. 
and over here, other than gems, which are all over the place, apparently. You know how I said in, that, in the last video that my two favorite mechanics in gaming are the run button and pogoing? What? Wait, what? What? Hey! Bigly, what are you doing here? <laughs> I'm just making sure you stick to your diet, Mr. McDuck. You're up here waking gold, Mrs. Bigly. Uh, if you'll pardon the expression. Huh. Of course. But I'll find my own way out, thank you very much. Wait, that. Uh, uh, Scrooge McDuck. Ah, oh, that's a life. Cool. So she traveled to space to make sure that we have a good diet. Yippee. Yippee. I wish I said yippee. More. Ah, another part of Gizmo. I've always wondered what Gyro was thinking when they designed this thing. Who fights crime with a unicycle? That's a good point. One more path to find, and I can get off this crime monstrosity. I could use my Metroidvania map. Okay. I actually can't, it's the funniest part. What, I haven't, I haven't marked on the map? That's awesome. This is like Metroid Zero Mission. This is like Metroid Duck Mission. What if there was a Metroid game, but Samus was just a duck? No one would complain. I wouldn't complain. Okay. That was a little cheap. Not gonna lie. You just throw in punches? Ah! Cool. This is like Metroid Golf. Why okay, haven't they released Metroid Golf yet? We are, none of the Metroid fans would complain. It'd be all like, oh, this is way better than Metroid Prime 4. Because, like, it would be. I don't want another Metroid Prime game, and there have only been three of those, you know? Just Metroid Doll. All the way. I'm joking, by the way. Although I haven't played a Metroid Prime game. I really want to. Like, I really want to. It's just that I need to, like, buy it on my Wii U. And, like, I don't know. It's a Wii U. No point in hanging around here. Okay. There he is. Looks like I found Gizmo Duck's armored suit. It's a good thing Gyro rigged up this hyperspace pocket for me to carry things around in. Yeah. Melted, I've got all three parts Called hammer space. Back to and Gyro. Huh, I hope it's not too late. I'm so gonna die on the way there. Like 
Can this be food or something? That'd be pretty cool. Oh, our heart! Yes! It definitely feels like a Mega Man game. Because, you know, Capcom made it, so. There's just so much about it that's Mega Man like. The music. Every oh, they should make one of these for Mega Man 2. They should make a Mega Man 2 rem remastered. That'd be so awesome. Oh my goodness, I'm getting a call. No. Wait. Why is there complete silence other than my footsteps? Um, so um. Oh my goodness. Guys, next time.